this video, I want to talk about all the ways in which we can treat and manage myopia so it doesn't get any worse. First of all, what is happening with myopia? Myopia occurs because the eyeball keeps growing longer. And when it grows longer, unfortunately, myopia gets worse. And children's vision fall away will never be the same. What can we do about it? There are many different treatment options for myopia. It can involve glasses, special eye drops, special contact lenses. So I wanna dig into each one of those separately. The first is glasses. We know that there are, we can actually design special glasses with special optics in the lens, sort of like a little bifocal that it can focus light on the retina differently than just a normal pair of glasses. When we do these types of special glasses, special readings, glasses, special bifocals, it can actually slow down how long the eye gets. Secondly, it's optically we can do contact lenses as well. So contact lenses, we can do multiple things. We can design just a quick, soft, multifocal lens with special optics in the lens. The optics of the lens has a bifocal or reading component in the soft contact lens. What it does is that it focuses light in front of the retina. I don't wanna to get too technical, but basically for some reason, when we focus light in front of the retina, then right on it or behind it, for some reason, that gives the eye a different signal so it knows not to grow so long. Lastly, there are special eye drops we can do. An eye drop that we usually do in office is called atropine. Atropine has been shown to induce a different type of signal in the eye so it doesn't grow as long. There are different, many different theories about why it can happen. Maybe it thickens the, the sclera or the cord of the eye. Maybe it blocks dopamine receptors or blocks certain neurotransmitter pathways that stops the signal to tell the eye to go longer. There are many different theories, but for some reason, when we have a diluted form of atropine, it can actually prevent myopia from getting worse. So these are just some of the many treatments we can do, and we're still trying to learn more. We're looking into diet. Maybe eating blueberries might be helpful. We're looking into environmental cues. For some reason, going outside and playing in the sun can even prevent myopia from potentially occurring in the first place. So there are many things you can do about myopia. What you shouldn't do though, is just accept it and think it's all purely genetic. We know now that there are many things we can do to intervene and potentially give our children a lifetime of better vision.